Good evening, class. Hello, Carlos. Good evening, teacher. How okay. are you? I'm great. Welcome. Uh, we still have three minutes left, okay? And okay. we're going to wait for the other partners to join in order to get started. Thank you for joining kind of early. Okay. Okay, okay thank you. Okay. Okay, Carlos, we're going to wait for the other partners to join to the class. We have a couple of seconds in order to get started. And only you, I don't know if they are having problems to log in like yesterday. Did you have any problem, Carlos? Do algún problema, Carlos, para ingresar? Solamente ayer, teacher. Okay. Porque eh, elegí, siempre me conectaba con el link de, que mandaron por correo a ellos. Ah, por, con el original, no por WhatsApp. El original, digamos. Exacto. Ah, ok. Sí, porque, ah, Flor is joining right now. Ok. Ok, so today is Wednesday, vacations are next door, two days left in order to be on vacation, right? And remember, tomorrow we have a class, and on Friday also we have a class. So everybody needs to be here. Ah, oh, Freddy Eliseo, hello, good evening. Cesar, Julio Cesar. I'm going to rename you Julio Cesar because you no, made this. Uh, ah, que tenía problemas al iniciar sesión. Why? ¿Por qué tenía problemas? Cuéntenos. Es que yo no, te, yo no eh, me, me meto con el enlace que metió al grupo, sino que me meto con el que tengo en el correo. No pues, con, la computadora. pues me decía Carlos que con ese se había unido mejor. Fíjese. No, a mí me pidió que me registrara nuevamente. Oh, sí, eso me, me pareció porque estaba muy extraño que solamente Carlos estuviera acá. Entonces pensé que algunos estaban teniendo problemas para unirse. Um, sí, sí, pero ya, ya lo resolví, gracias, Tisha. Ok, ¿y quién es promoyente tú, 29 al arroba gmail .com? No sé quién envió ese mensaje. Es con una cuenta de correo que lo envían. No con el usuario. Ok, so here. Ah, Rudy. Ok, Rudy. So sad that. Ok, class, let's get started. So we uh, finish on time. Ok, here we go. Wilbur. Welcome, Wilber, listener, Freddy's listener, Elizabeth Joanna, listener, 
Rudy, listener, only three students are going to be active. Carlos Ernesto, Julio, and Flor. Okay. And Miguel, I think. Okay, let's get started and here we go. Class, remember today is our session number 16. Okay, so only four more classes. And then you're going to be very soon in uh, level number four. So today is March 29th, 2023. Okay, and here we go. Today is our video conference number 16. And the agenda is as everyday greetings, feedback, objectives, and in the pre-task, the idea is to listen and practice a conversation model about travel services. The preparation task is to comprehend and use vocabulary about hotel services and create a checklist about the amenities and hotel services they will need for a trip. The task is to present a conversation role playing a hotel conversation. And we're going to be working at pages 39 and 40 and at the end the wrapping up of the class. So here we go. The objectives for today are this. I need one of you to be a volunteer in order to help me, okay? Reading the specific objective and the class objective. Who is going to be that participant? Me, teacher. Thank you so much, Carlos. Go ahead. The specific objective, the student will be able to request information about travel services, accommodation, and related to business trip. Okay, continue. Class objective, the student will be able to plan a trip and talk about the travel services accommodations they need to make to pre prepare their trip. Okay, thank you. Listen, I think that some of your partners are still having problems in order to look into the class. Mm -hmm. Algunos están teniendo problemas todavía para poder ingresar a los, a los salones. Probablemente sea alguna actualización de Zoom, ¿correcto? Ok, so, Carlos, I appreciate your participation, reading the objectives, the specific objective and the class objective. In class, as Carlos very well read and I mentioned in the agenda, today you are going to be able to request information about travel services, accommodations, and related to business trips. He also told you about the class objective, and it is that you will be able to plan a trip and talk about the travel services, accommodations they need to make uh, to prepare a trip. So here we go. Let's see. Again, homeworks and evaluations class. Remember, we only have four more classes left. Solo nos hacen falta cuatro clases más para que termine el módulo. Y hay personas que aún están pendientes con muchas tareas y con la evaluación del midterm de la semana 2. Les pido de favor que completen todos sus homeworks y los exámenes, las evaluaciones, ¿de acuerdo? Cuando vengamos de vacaciones, eso tiene que estar terminadito ya, ¿ok? And then here we go. The requirements, your full name, when you get connected to the platform. In the case that you are listeners, add the word oyente luego de su nombre. The camera on during the session. Minimize the sound as much as possible and active, active participation, okay? Active participation. In the uh, activities in class and also in the breakout rooms. So here the attendance, it is expected that you stay 100% of the class. In other words, 120 minutes of classes is the required of the connectivity. And the attendance will be taken twice, okay? At about 8.20 and at about 9.40. Remember, it is going to be taken as effective attendance when we listen to your voice and your camera is on. When we listen to your voice saying, presente, here I am, I am or here or present. And at the end, one-on-one -on -one session is available for one of you, okay? And 
sorry, but permissions are not available. And here we have a reminder that this is the expected okay, attendance. Así se espera que estén todos, ¿verdad? Como se, cuando se registraron, se les dijo que así debían estar. Entonces, así es como se espera. Por eso nos comparte la administración esta imagen para ustedes. And the bottom of silence, in other words, the microphone off, unless you are told not to do so, the camera on, the two chats available, the breakout rooms will be available for you during the session, and the bottom for ask for help will be available too. And also respect above all, okay? And here we are. Today is the 29th, so we are beginning today our week number four. Remember for the ones who are a little bit uh, behind in your homeworks in the platform, that uh, we're going to be finishing on April the 11th, yeah? So that is why I need you to finish your homeworks in the platform by Monday, April the 10th, okay? Necesito que actualicen sus tareas quienes están pendientes con tareas desde la sección 1, ¿de acuerdo? Okay, and now here we go. Let's get started. But before we get started with the new topic for today class, let's go over the feedback class. What do you remember about what we practiced yesterday in class, okay? Tell me an example of what we practiced yesterday in class. Lo que practicamos ayer en clase. Do you remember? Don't let me down, please. What did you practice yesterday in class? It was the okay, general okay. field, but yes, uh, Rafael, welcome. Uh, Tell sentences me. Uh, we use, um, could you mind, would you mind, would you mind or could you? Okay. Excellent, okay. very well. In other words, we did a general feedback or review on the contents for section three or unit three. Yes, is that correct? And you Correct. were checking also mistakes, yeah? You were correcting some sentences. And here I'm going to show you. Where is it? Okay, over here. And here we go. Yesterday, you were working on this. You were working in the vocabulary practice, yeah? On communication and etiquette. And you found 10 words from the box below. In this word search, these words were found here and you chose five of these words and you wrote sentences, yeah? As a team, you began to create sentences and you shared with the class. And after that, what you were saying, Rafael, in a very correct way, you were identifying and correct three mistakes in the request below using would you mind and could you, yeah? And remember that when we use the structure, would you mind, the verb must be in I-N-G. Otherwise, it is absolutely incorrect. And then in exercise four, you were selecting the most appropriate answer for the questions that were posted here from number one to number five. And you had two choices, either A, or B, and later we double check this activity. Is that correct? In number five, you were writing suggestions about the following behaviors at work. And then you have five situations and you provided suggestions. And at the end, as a class and as the wrapping up of the class, we were classifying the salutations and closings into formal or informal, right? And you were dictating to me and I was writing over here. Is that okay? Is that what we did yesterday? Yes or no? Yes, yes, yes. yes. Okay, very well. Now here we go. We are going to get started with the new topic and the last big topic that we're going to be working with in this uh, level, okay? So here we go. I want you to notice this class, okay? Accommodation, what is the meaning of the word accommodation? Accommodation is a place such as a room in a hotel 
where travelers can sleep and find other services. Amenities, plural, the features of the hotel that are available for guests to use. For example, a gym, a pool, a minibar, a jacuzzi, etc. Those are the amenities in a hotel, in a resort, but also a city has different amenities. Yes or no? Yes. Yes. Teacher. Okay, very well. So I need you to remember the meaning of these words, accommodation and amenities. Why? Because we are going to use them right now. Uh, let me see, probably, okay. Here we have these situations. It is for you speaking time. Do you usually go on business trips? What are three hotel services? For example, wake up call, business center, or laundry, etc., that you often use when you stay in a hotel for business trips. Okay? So this is the first part, only the speaking part. You ask to your classmates, do you usually go on a business trip? Then they answer, yes, I do. No, I don't. Or you say sometimes, rarely, okay, not frequently, not very often. It depends. And later, what are three hotel services okay, that you often use? For example, wake up call, the business center, the laundry, uh, room service, and others that you might use. Is that okay? Yes? It's okay, teacher. Okay. Yes. So I'm going to share these questions with you right now, right away, via WhatsApp. So you can go over the breakout rooms and then you ask and answer these questions, okay? Remember active participation. You have it in there via WhatsApp. And right now, hello, Evelyn, welcome. Flor, welcome. Catherine, welcome. Uh, Maria Leticia, Leti, welcome. Andrea Elizabeth, welcome. Isabel, hello, finally, yeah. Mm, let me see. And the other side, ah, Mervin, Miguel also, and uh, Rafael. The others, I already greeted them at the beginning of the class. So here we go. You are going to work in the breakout rooms, asking and answering the questions that I shared with you via WhatsApp. Is that okay? Only five minutes for that. Here we okay. go. Okay. Go to your groups, please. Okay. Okay, I sent you the invitation. Okay. Go to your groups. Catherine, I need you to go to your group, please. Uh, Johanna, Elizabeth Johanna, please go to your group. Catherine, again, go to your group. And Wilbur, okay. I need you in your group's class. Pregunta. Pero también las compartió en, en, en el grupo de WhatsApp. Es que lo que pasa es que tengo el teléfono cargando. Mm. Y como ya no me pude conectar desde la computadora porque no me daba acceso. Ah, estoy pues en la página 39. En un lado viendo. Exercise 39. number one at page 39, ¿ok? Do you usually go on business trips? What are three hotel services? Bla, 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 that you... Uh, often use in a hotel. Eh, teacher, y en un caso, vaya, por ejemplo, yo, <ríe> yes. eh, que no, no realizo nada de eso, eh, sería un hipotéticamente lo que yo diría. Yes, yes, 
Okay. Yes, the idea is to use the language, okay? Okay. Vaya, tengo la 39. Sí, el numeral 1, arriba. Ah, que responder, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. But it, it is oral, orally, trip. orally, orally. Speaking, only speaking. Okay. En español. <laughs> okay, Virginia, let me see. Virginia goes to group. Aquí solo tenemos que responder la número uno, ¿verdad? No, oh, la dos. Ajá, las dos preguntas, pero del, 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 del rombo uno. Sí, sí, de la actividad uno. Sí. ¿Sueles realizar viajes de negocio? Elisa me dice que no. Elizabeth Johanna. Yes, I do or no, I don't. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> uh, bueno, y como es, no hay dos. Yes, I do y no, I don't. Pero en la primera, por ejemplo, que dice que si suenas hacer viajes de negocio, eh, eh, ahí podría ser cualquiera de las dos. Si uno Ajá. viaja o el otro si viaja. Ajá, correcto. Por eso puse las dos. No sé si se logra, logran ver el word. Sí. Ok, Julio. Ay, sí, sí, se puede ver. Ah, ok, thank you. Yes, do you usually go on business trip? Yes, I do. No, I don't. According to your reality, you, you say what it is, right? Uh, we take decisions to, to, to put both answer teachers. Why both? Uh, no, but, uh, you, but in it, your case, in your case, do you usually in, go on business trip? Yes, I do or no, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, because it is a speaking time, orally. Okay, and Evelyn, your answer is? Okay. Evelyn. Okay. Your okay. answer to the question, do you usually go on business trips? Yes, I do or no, I don't. No, I don't. Okay, now Carlos ask the question to, to Miguel. Uh, okay, do you usually, uh, Miguel, do you usually go on business trips? Hi, Miguel. Yes. yes, I do. Okay. And now Miguel. Yo estoy teniendo problemas de. De audio. Hola, hola. Hola, hola le hola, escuchamos Miguel. perfectamente, Miguel. Le escuchamos bien, Miguel. Ah, ok. Ok, Miguel, es now que me you... está fallando, pero sí. Uh, yes, okay. yes, yes. Now you, chale, ask chale, the... you ask the question to Julio. Dame. Miguel, read the questions for Julio. Julio is going to answer to you. Julio le va a contestar okay, la pregunta. Ajá. No, do you usually the go... The first question. Yeah, the first question. Ah, okay. Okay, uh, do you usually go on business trips, Julio? No, I'm not. No, I'm not, no. No, I don't. No, I'm not. No, 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 no. Léame acá el negativo, ¿qué es lo que dice aquí? No. No. No, I don't. No, I don't. Ajá, pero usted decía, no, I'm not. No puede ser I'm not porque le están preguntando con do. ¿De acuerdo? Vamos a Hay que responder con, con el, con el, el mismo auxiliar, con el mismo auxiliar. Por eso ya les escribieron acá las opciones. Yes, I do or no, I don't. Y acá les hace falta una coma después de yes and after no. Now listen, since uh, most of you answered in a negative way, use your imagination in order to answer 
this uh, second questions, okay? Imagine that you are in a you are on a business trip uh, and you are at the hotel. What are three hotel services that you uh, are going to use? ¿Cuáles son esos tres servicios que ustedes usarían? Menciónenlos, ¿ok? Uh, ok. okay. Yes. Uh, teacher, gimnasio, ¿cómo se diría? Gym. 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 Ah, ok. okay. Gym. Uh, it save statement. Sobre las siguientes afirmaciones son falsas o verdaderas. Pero de cuáles afirmaciones, si no sé. ¿Y de qué están hablando ustedes? <risa> no, ustedes están en otra cosa. Miren, por eso cuando les pregunto, contestan porque no otra cosa, porque nos siguen instrucciones. Vaya, le voy a preguntar acá a Virginia. Sí. Virginia, ok. Uy, Virginia. Okay, over here. Um, the question is, do you usually go on business trips? Mm, I never, teacher. No, ahí me tiene que contestar. No, I don't, porque le estoy preguntando con do you. Uh -huh. Yes, I do or no, I don't. Yes, yes, no question. And uh -huh. then, uh, Rafael, do you usually go on business trips? I no, I don't, teacher. Okay. In actually, this and actually work, no. No, actually work, no. Porque okay. actually quiere decir, um, de hecho, en efecto, realmente, no actualmente. Mm. Sería currently, currently. Okay. In my currently work, I don't. Okay. I don't. Now use your imagination. Imagine that you are on a business trip okay. and you are at the hotel at this moment. What are three hotel services that you use? For example, the wake up call uh, or uh, the laundry, the internet connectivity, the business center, the gym. Which are the services that you need or room service probably? Which are those uh -huh. that you would use? ¿Cuáles serían esos que ustedes usarían? Um... Number one, sería room service. Okay. Number two, uh, laundries, laundry service. And number three, um, what is the, the piscina? Uh, the pool, the swimming pool. The pool, the swimming pool. The swimming pool, okay. Swimming pool. And what about you, Virginia? Hmm? What services would you use? What services would you use? Service. What services would you use? What services would you use? Okay, that is one. Another one because you need to mention three. Mm -hmm. Um, number one, restaurant. Um, number number two, number two, it and far. Hmm? Which and, is number two? Uh, laundry. Laundry. ¿Sabe lo que es laundry? La lavandería, verdad? Sí, Lander. por eso. En, en number three. Number three, Miss. Y, y, course, course, hmm? course center. Sí. Okay, now let's return because the other ones are uh, listeners, so they don't participate. Let's get back to the main session room, okay? Okay. And then we're going to share with the partners. Okay, Virginia and Rafa. 
Let's wait for the others. And here we go with Catherine, Andrea, Elizabeth, Elizabeth, Johanna, eh, Fredis, Maria Leticia. In 20 seconds, everybody will be back. Maria Isabel is here. Present teacher. Hello. Yeah. Hold it. I'm not calling your name for the attendance list. Yes. Yeah, yet. Yet. Um, Andrea Lisbeth. Okay, very good. Let me see if there is somebody else. No, you are the ones. I hope that all of you are here. Okay. Um, now I'm going to call your names. Uh, Andrea Lisbeth. Andrea Lisbeth, thank you. Mm, Carlos. Okay, Carlos. Present, teacher, present. Thank you. Elizabeth Johanna. Present. Thank you. Evelyn. Present. Thank you. Flor Morena. Flor, where are you? Ah. I so thought that you had lost the connectivity, and I was going to say, oh, but she was here. Fredis? Okay. Hazel? She's absent at the moment, okay? Julio Cesar? Where are Present. you? Catherine? Present. Thank you. Maria Isabel? Isabel. Leti, Maria Leticia. Present teacher. Thank you. <coughs> Mervin Osvaldo. Eh, Mateo. Mateo, are you here? No, he's absent at the moment. Miguel Angel. Yes. Present teacher. Thank you. Natalia, Absolutely. Rafa, always here. 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 Okay, here always teacher. here. Yes. Rudy, as a listener, he said. Virginia. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss Virginia. Wendy is absent and Wilbur is absent, okay? Wilbur is absent today. I está en mensaje, Wilbur. No, yo no lo veo si no está. ¿Dónde está Wilbur? Let me see. In, the, in the chat of the Zoom. Mm. Okay. Because it says it's going to be effective, the attendance, when we listen to the students say, here I am, presente. Así dice, si o no, la slide yes. va a ser efectiva cuando. <laughs> Probably he's at the beach again. Okay, thank you, Wilbur. <laughs> it's a joke. Okay, class, listen. You were discussing the questions. Do you usually go on a business trip? Because in some positions, it is necessary to make some trips, okay? Probably you need to visit one branch from San Salvador to La Union or to Sonsonate, but not only for one day, maybe two or three days, because you need, if you are an accountant or Okay, if you are the auditor or if you want to check the procedures in there, and then you need to stay in a hotel, correct? Imagine okay. that you have to stay in a hotel. Every hotel uh, offers some amenities, yeah, to the, to the guests, para los huéspedes. So okay. uh, in some cases, some of you said, no, I never go on business trip. And then I said, okay, use your imagination and think about this. Picture yourself in a hotel because you are on a business trip. And which services would, would you use in a hotel? And some of them were saying laundry. Some others were saying, uh, what else? Ah, somebody said swimming pool, yes. And uh, what else do I remember? Gym. The gym, yes, the gym. very well. The internet service. 
okay the internet service but there are some hotels that don't have all those amenities they just have a few yes depending on the, how many stars the hotel is yes or no dependiendo de cuántas estrellas sea el hotel porque si es de media estrella okay. yes, no creo ya no creo. Yeah, believe me <risa> y uno que dicen ser cuatro estrellas pero son ni, do, ni a dos llegan verdad yeah. y te cobran como de cinco entonces sí, correcto. El, el, el de una estrella es con ventilador <risa> very hot in these days ok listen because not all of them can afford a gym or a big swimming pool yes mm -hmm. ah, sí. ajá. Ah, o sauna sauna no, yes, and, and but the that, spa, is the pen, that is the, the penthouse, spa. awesome, and also uh, beauty salon. Some of them yes, offer beauty, beauty salon. salon. Okay, sure. very, yes, sir. But well, what do you think about the Airbnb? The uh, Airbnb, actually, the, they are they, Airbnb. Uh -huh, they are accommodations, but they are not hotels because yeah. they are private, uh, private properties, and they offer you something via internet sometimes it is for real some other times they show the facilities you know facilities like installations of okay. another place because when people from other countries come to the facilities they feel disappointed because one thing is on internet and there is one uh, something else in reality yeah so okay. it is like not so I would say that I am like uh, not so um, not so in that mood of being uh, working with Airbnb because you don't know in the end. Yeah, and sometimes it is not even the owner who is offering the the place. Eh, it's a lie, veces, No siempre. Muchas veces no es ni siquiera el dueño quien oferta el lugar, ¿verdad? Okay, uh, so it is like tricky. Es como un poquito complicado eso, okay? But okay. anyways, the idea is that because in this unit we are going to be uh, working with that vocabulary. So here we go. Let's continue, class. And now, okay, what page 39? Listen to your teacher, read the conversation, then practice with a partner. Okay, so here we go. Let's see what's going on over here. It is um, exercise number two. It is about a phone call to a travel agency. Listen to your teacher read the conversation and practice with a partner. A phone call to a travel agency. The agent and Rose. Okay, here. Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mrs. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in? A uh, smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, so you know the shuttle service, okay? Si saben sobre el shuttle Es el microbus que te trae del, oh, okay. de, from the airport. The, uh, uh -huh, the, okay. the transportation that the you trans take from uh, the airport to the hotel. Yeah? Uh, okay. Okay. But there are some hotels that they have their own vehicles, yeah, their own transportations. So right now, um, here I need a boy and a girl because the girl is going to be the customer and the agent from the travel agency is going to be a boy, okay? Who is going to be the agent? ¿Qué va a ser el agente de viajes? It's me. Okay, thank you. And I need the customer. One lady. One girl. 
<clears throat> okay, I'm going to choose the victim then because no volunteers, no <laughs> girls volunteer. They are very me. shy. Me, 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 okay, me. I want, okay, Letty. I was wondering, where is Letty? I don't listen to her. Okay, okay. class, here we go. Okay, to the count of three. Uh, Letty, you're going to read Rose. You are Rosa. Rosa Puentes. Okay. And the travel agent is here. Let's begin. One, two, three. Mark's travel agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or not a smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Very well. Now switch roles. No matter. Okay. Now you are uh, Letty. You are Mark, and you are the customer. In this case, uh, you impersonate Rosa Puentes. Okay, Rafael. Okay. One, two, three. Mark, Mark Tribal Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking room, please. Are you going to need the sure Shural. service? Sure. Sure service? <clears throat> yes, please. Okay, thank you so much. And then we have sure service, a reservation, a smoking or non-smoking room, sure service. Okay. So remember, Mark's Travel Agency, this is the name of the company, company. Mark's Travel Agency. So the agent can be a boy or a girl. But in this case, I decided that the agent should begin being a boy. So class, we are going to be working. I need you to read this, but please make an emphasis on the pronunciation because the idea is not just to read and okay, we finish reading, no. You need to articulate the words, yeah? And here, shuttle service, smoking, non-smoking room. Salón para fumar o habitación donde se puede fumar, habitación non-smoking donde no puedes fumar, okay? So yeah. once again, Mark's Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure, may I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking room, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please, okay? So class, you practice this conversation, you switch roles and in the pair work you read again and you say, you determine if these sentences are true or false. And exercise number four, I already uh, shared with you at the beginning of the class, the definition for the word accommodation and amenities. Are we clear about the activity? Yes? Yes. Okay. Yes, teacher. I'm yes, teacher. Now I'm going to transfer you to the breakout room, but I need you to be speaking, okay? Speaking time. Here we go. Everybody participating, please. Okay. 
Come. Okay. Let me see. Four, 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 and four. Okay. Four students in each group. I'm going to send you the invitation. Join your groups, please. Okay. Here we go. Okay. May I have your name, please? Of course, I am Rosa Fuentes. Thank you, Miss Fuentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Um, non smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, okay. the Road, uh, March Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. We are going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Fuente. Thank you, Miss Fuentes. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, uh, Elizabeth, with Wilbur, no, Wilbur maybe is, is not able. Hola, hola. ¿Con quién practicaría yo? Uh, si gusta conmigo, uh, Mars Travel Agency, how can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 13th. I am going to stay three days. Are you going to days in smoking or not smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need the uh, sure service? Yes, please. Okay. Uh, Miguel. Creo que <laughs> tiene mala la conexión. Miguel, hello, knock, knock. Are you here? Knock, knock, somebody here, Miguel Angel. If you don't listen to me or to your partners, please write in the chat. Okay, Miguel. Okay, girls, both of you read. Ah, así no se escucha. <laughs> Muy bien, perfecto. Y, y nos puede hablar. Hello, hello, si está en este universo, manifiestese, give us a sign, denos una señal. Lo siento, justo cuando usted ingresó, ya no pude escuchar yo. Ah. Pero justamente en este momento preciso, usted va a practicar con una de las chicas. Ok, your choices okay. are Virginia and Evelyn. You have to choose one, yes or yes. Tiene que seleccionar a una chica sí o sí para practicar, ¿ok? Yes. I begin so, with Evelyn. Ok. <laughs> ok. Um, agent, and you 
puede pronunciarla como que fuera una R, entonces puede decir shuttle service. That's ¿Y dónde correct. empieza Rosa? Eh, la número, ¿cuál? La primera que empieza a decir Rosa. Eh, good morning. Good morning. I... I need a reservation for a single room. Mm -hmm. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica mm -hmm. on April 14. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another? Can room please? Single room, estamos bien. Uh -huh. Ok. Esperamos la última. Empieza usted yo. Sí. Mark's Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? No smoking, please. Are you going to need the sure service? Yes, please. Okay. Hoy empiezo yo y usted dos. Okay. Mark Travel Agency, how, how can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I am going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course, I am Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I am going to stay three days. Are you going to stay, stay in a smoking or no smoking room? No smoking room, please. Are you, are you to need the surely server? Are you going to need? Are you going are to you need? Going to, are you going to need the surely server? Yes, please. Okay. Sure, uh, Marvin, sure service. Sure service. Sure? Sure. Service. Como con sure. la L al final. Uh -huh. Sure. Sure. Uh -huh. sure. sure. Shurol. Shurol. Okay. Shurol. La lengua se... Shurol. Mm -hmm. Shurol. 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 Recuerde, service. porque show es un service. hotel, entonces sería como um, room service, servicio de habitación, ya, parecido. Mm -hmm. okay. Sí. ok, now go over the sentences and decide if they are true or false, ok? Ok. okay. Rosa, need a double room. Pero, teacher, I yes, have tell a me. question. Okay. Uh, how about with this with the sentence and number four? Because say uh, that Rosa is going to read a card at the at the at the airport, um, and the answer is false. Yes, it is false. It's false. Ah, okay. Yeah, because at the airport there are rental cars. Ah. Because okay. it, it says, "Are you going to need the short service?" Yes, please. Because the hotel is offering the service of transportation. Otherwise, she, she would say, no, thank you. I'm going to uh, rent, a car. rent a car. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, 
So let's see the uh, rows uh, and let's uh, our room for sure. It will stay for three days. True, Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room for Okay, yes. Sure, ¿qué significa como tal? El, el, es el así. transporte, así, ese es el nombre que tiene la, el transporte. Ah, uh -huh. el sure, el sure. sure. O sea, se debe de entender. Es un servicio que... que da el hotel, sí. Ah, ok. Sí, es. Ok, thank you. Recuerde que no debemos ir traduciendo palabra por palabra porque Tan hay literal, palabras... Bo correcto, que no tiene traducción al español tal cual mm -hmm. como nosotros desearíamos, ok ok so, aquí practicó con Julio y las otras dos personas no participaron Elizabeth, sí uh -huh. eh, ¿quién más? Yo creo que Wilbur, Wilbur no está disponible oh. ahí solo con Julio y Elizabeth Wilbur, are you sí. there? Intercambiaron roles. Yes, switch the role. Okay, so it is time, I think, to return. Okay. To the main session room, yeah, because. Uh, Teacher, in this case, uh, excuse the words name, uh, uh, check in and check out. Sí, pero eso es cuando usted ya está en el hotel. Ah, Ajá, okay. cuando usted ingresa es el check-in y cuando okay. se retira es el check-out. ¿Sí? Ok, ok. Porque okay. check-out es cuando you pay uh, what, okay, what you are owing to the hotel, it can be in cash. Mm -hmm. Ok. Has, but uh, American people basically they use more um, plastic, plastic money than okay. cash. Yes. Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Because it is um, safer and easier to carry in your pocket than to have a lot of money. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Okay. It's better to pay in the plastic money. Yeah. When traveling, yes, it is better. So let's okay. return to the main session room. In eight seconds, everybody will be back. Okay, great. So class, here we go. Mm, let's see. I need... Uh, Let me see Flora, Flora and Marvin. Are you available, Marvin? Hola. Marvin, are you available? Yes. Okay. Sí. And uh, Evelyn. Le yeah. Uh, no, Flor, Flor, Flor. Okay. Here we go. Please read the conversation. Okay. Mark Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. Single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure, Mary. I have I have your name, please. Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? Stay. I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or no smoking room? No smoking, no smoking, please. 
Are you going to need the churl service? Yes, please. Yes. Okay, here we go. Mark's travel agency, how can I help you? How can I help you? Good morning, I need a reservation. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure, may you pronounce this word, this modal auxiliary as the month of the year. Pronunciamos este modal auxiliary como el mes de mayo, sí, may. May I have your name, please? Of course, I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking room, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Remember that you work in a travel agency. So you need to speak clearly and kind of slowly. Why? Because you are taking someone else's information in order to make a reservation, yeah? So it is very necessary to speak clearly and to ask to the other person to speak slowly because you are taking note. Es necesario, si es posible, pedirle a la otra persona que hable más despacio porque usted está tomando nota de nombre y apellido para la reservación, ¿sí? Recuerde que es importante porque se pueden confundir los nombres o los apellidos, ¿sí? And then here we have the uh, two choices that this hotel offers, a smoking or non-smoking room. In some places, they are very eco-friendly and healthy and they don't uh, they don't have the spaces for smoking no tienen espacios para fumar sí en algunos lugares en otros sí tienen las dos eh, the shuttle service not all the hotels have them el servicio de transporte no todos los hoteles lo tienen ya because remember that there is the taxi uh, service and also now we have the different platforms that offer the the transportation, correct? Or you uh, maybe decided to rent a car, but the hotel needs to ask you about it. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Va a necesitar el servicio de transporte. ¿Qué le ofrecemos nosotros? Sometimes they don't have it, but they make the connections for you. Pero ellos hacen la conexión because they have contacts with drivers or with different companies correct that offer the service okay so one okay. more thing that i remember here um, only that okay the the pronunciation of the modal auxiliary may i have your name please puede decirme su nombre puede darme su nombre no decimos eh, can you give me your name no no se puede traducir eso literal May I have your name, please? Okay. Similar a, may I go to the bathroom. ¿Se recuerdan de esa frase? Muy amable y cortés piden permiso, ¿verdad? Para retirarse e ir al bathroom. May I have your name, please? Mire, lleva la palabrita please. Quiere decir que es un polite request. Okay. Now, let's move to the next activity. Say if the statements below are true or false. Class, what do you think? Rose needs a double room, true or false? False. 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 Okay, it is false. Now, Rosa is going to stay for three days. True. 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 Okay, it is true. And Rosa is going to stay in a smoking room. False. 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 Rosa is going to rent a car at the airport. False. False. False, because she's going to use the shuttle, shuttle service. service. Okay, very well. So I think that we are clear about the vocabulary and also about the meaning of the word accommodation and amenities. It is plural, okay? And now I'm going to share this link with you so you listen to it. It is a phone call, making a hotel reservation, okay? If you have the digital uh, book, you may log in, okay? So here, 
I need you to listen to this. I'm going to share it. Is it okay if I share it via WhatsApp? Yes. Yes. But you have it also in your, in your manual, okay? It is a listening practice. Okay, now via this chat, via Zoom. Okay, there you are. Okay, log in and tell me if you have any problem. <clears throat> Let me see. Hotel booking. Okay. Okay, so you listen to it carefully. I'm going to, I need your microphones off so we don't interrupt the others. I'm going to silence you, Letty. Okay, great. This is like a audio or conversation or podcast. It is an audio. Okay, thank you. Okay. Sería donde dice el lesion claim. Porque a mí me aparece, me aparece un audio, pero no me lo da, no me lo arranca. Y el último, el último es compañero. Oh, ya, yeah, ya, yeah, ya, yeah. ya, yeah. gracias. Ok, de hotel audio. Ok. Mm -hmm. Listen, one idea is this. You click on the hotel booking audio and also in the audio script. So you listen and you read at the same time, okay? Abren las dos ventanitas. Una la del audio y la otra la del eh, el script. Es decir, el audio pero en letras. So you have the two practices, listening and reading. Ah, okay, teacher, okay. Open the audio script and uh, the, and audio. the audio, yeah, and the booking audio. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. When you finish the listening activity, you tell me, okay?
finish class. Did you finish the listening practice? Yes, teacher. Finish okay. Yes, teacher. okay, now we're going to go over the second part of the activity. And here we go. Okay, class, please tell me some of the words. We're going to write a list of vocabulary that you remember from the uh, listening activity, okay? So tell me some of the words that you remember or expressions that you remember are? I'm uh, afraid no. so, teacher. I'm afraid. I'm, I'm afraid so. Afraid so. Me temo que. Que sí. Okay. Okay. No, no adjacent. adjacent to. Eh? Not. Not. I se lo escribí, teacher. Not adjacent to. To. No, Where? In the. Quiero ver, solo. Not adjacent to. No, ah, no es adyacente, no es, aunque no esté adyacente, es decir, par. What does not ah, adjacent to mean? Ajá. No está ah, a la par. Ajá, que no esté adyacente, pues, ajá, cerca. Ok. Ok, because okay. some people make a reservation and they need to be close to something or to another room, ya. Yeah. Ok. Ok, uh, another word or... Ok. Or expression that you remember? Mm. Only those. The other ones were normal. Do they do they mention something about transportation? Teacher. In I am querying teacher. Inquiring. In, wearing, inquiring. 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 Okay. Okay, read the context. I am inquiring uh, about the room rate. Uh, yes, I am inquiring. Uh, rate. Rate, yes. Okay, estoy uh, averiguando o investigando sobre las tarifas de las habitaciones. Uh, ah, okay. Inquiring is averiguar o preguntar. Uh -huh. To research, oh. investigate. Uh, research. Investigate. Cotizando, uh -huh. cotizando, verificando, ah, okay. revisando. It, it has different meanings, okay? That's why I asked you about the context. Okay. Okay, okay. okay, very well. Excellent. Now you have a different experience and a different conversation from the one that is shared in the manual to you, yeah? Okay, now let's continue. And here, we have this. This is a piece of cake for you guys, okay? Label the pictures with the corresponding uh, words from the box. Shuttle service, single room, wake up call, Wi-Fi, internet, business center, fridge in the room, safe and laundry service, okay? You are going to uh, write over here, yeah? the name of the service according to the pictures yes like a like a matches yeah similar matching because label the pictures label okay. the pictures with the corresponding words from the box okay, okay. Mm When you finish, please tell me, okay?
in each teacher. Finish teacher. Okay, one more minute for the rest of the class. Teacher, may I share the Not slides? yet, not yet. Wait for okay. the others to finish in one minute, okay? Okay. One minute, you're going to share it. Okay. Finish, teacher. Thank you for telling me. Okay, I'm going to stop sharing because Carlos is going to share his work. Thank you. A ver. Okay, Carlos. Okay, se logra ver, teacher. Yes, explain it to the class. Ah, okay. Number one the... is, for me, okay. number one is. Mm -hmm. Okay, and um, for me, the number one label the teacher is wake up. And then second, the laundry service. Number three, fridge in the room. And four, business center. Uh, five, it's safe. Six, single room. And number seven, shuttle service. And finally, number eight, Wi Fi intern. Excellent. Very well. That's it. Did you double check class? Did you get them all correct or do you have any comments? Something that you think could be changed or everything is okay? For me, everything is okay, teacher. Okay, thank you for answering, Rafa. Thank you, Carlos. Well okay, done, teacher. thank you for sharing, great. Okay. Now okay. class, what are you going to <clears throat> Mateo is here. Okay, Matthew, I was calling your name at the beginning, but okay, you are here. That's great. Listen, class. I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms. And I need you to write a list of amenities that visitors or any tourists can find in San Salvador City. The amenities, yeah? For example, let's see, you start uh, writing the list, but this is just an example. And remember that you use your ideas and you make your choices, okay? Depending on what you decide as a group. So maybe um, amenities in San Salvador city let's imagine that you are going to offer yeah you belong to the ministry of tourism in el salvador and only in san salvador not in the country only in san salvador some of the amenities are that we can offer to visitors okay tell me um there is a theater yes or theater. no okay. yes teacher another one cinema teacher Ah, cinema, yes. Okay, and you continue. This is just the idea. Now um, I'm going to transfer you. But remember that only in San Salvador, solo en San Salvador, yes? Okay. Okay, so here we go. 
I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms. And you have five minutes to do this activity. Okay, I'm going to recreate because I see that there are some other partners over here. I'm asking the platform to recreate. Hmm. Okay, hold it. Okay, me está dejando tres y cuatro oyentes en un solo grupo y una persona nada más. Participant. Okay, go to your groups. Join your groups and begin writing the list of amenities San Salvador offers to tourists. Okay, Isabel, your group is number one. We're going to be waiting for you. Okay, here we are, Catherine, uh, Mervin, Elizabeth, Johanna, and Flor. Okay, let's get this started, guys. Let's begin writing the list of amenities San Salvador offers to visitors from all the countries around the world. Uh -huh. Volcan Volcano trip or, or trip in... Bueno, una podría ser tours at the city, por ejemplo, porque ya los hay. Tours... City tours, city tours. City, city tours. Okay. Mm. Teacher, mm -hmm. uh, uh, how can I say a uh, volcano trip or oh, los viajes que se hacen al, al boquerón, no sé. Volcan volcanoes, uh, San Salvador, volcanoes, San Salvador, volcano trip. Or okay. tour, 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 they use the word tour, tour. Tour to vol Volcanos Tour or only tour? San Salvador's Volcano Tour. Okay. Bye, because in room number four, they need me. Bye. Okay, Evelyn, hello. Hola, teacher. Este, una pregunta. Yo entendí que vamos a escribir una lista de los servicios que encontramos en San Salvador. No, de las amenities. Mm. Son los atractivos, las atracciones que San Salvador ofrece a los turistas. Oh, okay. Por eso eh, en la lista estaba en la que comenzamos theater, cinemas, ya. Yeah. Uh -huh. Traditional theater de cinema, pero solo en San Salvador. Pero, amenities. Ajá, pero amenities. no, o sea, las que nosotros queramos poner. O amenities, ¿qué significa, dicho? Atracciones. Ok, I'm going to answer your question. Here you have it, amenities, the features of the hotel, in this case of the city, right, that are av available for guests to use. Mm -hmm. eh, son las atracciones disponibles que le ofrece San Salvador a los turistas, los atractivos. Okay. Attractions. Mm -hmm. Pero solo de la ciudad de San okay. Salvador, porque si no serían muchos. Okay. <laughs> Yes. Okay. Okay. What, what okay. do you say? Uh, monumento. Monument. Monument. Monumento. Monumento. Monumento al divino sal. Salvador del mundo. Monument. Monumento se escribe igual, solo que le falta la O. You eliminate O. Yes. You delete letter O. Okay. Okay. Thank you. My pleasure. Wilbur. Wilber, are you here? Y Wilber, que no estaba en otro grupo. Um, pues está de oyente. Sí. Ay, es que era en el anterior. Que lo, que lo, que lo estaba ubicando, ok. Pero ahora, como ya hay más participantes, ya se creó otro equipo. 
Okay. Is it clear, okay. Miss Evelyn? Yes. Yes. Yes, okay. teacher. Okay. Continue working. Bye. Thank you. Yes. Okay. Que no sé yo. Se lo veo, no sé si es, es que están en el manual están solamente cinco porque la otra es algo adicional o no sé si ah. es uno por cada uno de nosotros porque dice después que los comparemos y qué están haciendo ustedes disculpen la pregunta <risa> No, only, only, only say, only say eh, because, es que solo estábamos hablando de, la, de las atracciones que hay, ¿verdad? No, y, y mencioné... tienen que hacer el listado de las amenities San Salvador offers to the visitors. Esa es la instrucción. Tienen que crear un listado de las amenities que San Salvador le ofrece a sus visitantes. Um, ok. Ok. Tienen tres minutos más. Uh -huh. ah, y luego bien. seleccionan quién la va a presentar en el, en el main session room. Ok. Ahí siempre van. Y por eso, ay, que no lo terminamos porque estaban haciendo. Ups. Ah. ¿Verdad, Virginia? ¿Es cierto, Virginia, o no? Ajá, yours. Ok. Bye, okay. bye. Bye, teacher. Sí, no, bye, bye. Bye, bye. No, si es que ya todo el mundo. Ok. Bye. bye. See you later. Bye, teacher. See you. Uh, um, yes. No lo Hot. tenemos todavía. No. No, no, no. no. Variety, no. Of, variety of hotel. Uh, malls, centros yes. comerciales. Yes. Ah, yeah. malls, ya. Yeah. Ok, malls. Uh, let's mm. see, Cucatlan Park. Cultural centers. Um, the, um, Palacio Nacional. Churches, churches, iglesias. Uh, churches, yes. Uh, yes. San Salvador Downtown. Historic yes, San Salvador yes. Downtown. San yes, Salvador, sure. Historic Downtown. Historic Downtown. No, Historic. Histórico, no historia. Historic, no. Con I latina. History. Historic. historic. Adjetivo, no nombre. Ajá, uh, Historic Downtown. Downtown. El centro de San Salvador. Downtown. Oh. No. Con N. Downtown. Primero va la W. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, sorry, teacher. San Salvador sorry. Historic Downtown Churches. What else? Ah, uh, her salon, spa, hospital, museum, rent a car, financial center. Universities. Universities. La Universidad del de Salvador. Ah. Sí. Pero como visita, no como para estudios. Ah, no, como visita. Okay. University. Okay. Universidad del de Salvador. El Salvador con letra mayúscula, por favor. Ok. University. University de El Salvador, uh, Financial Center, San Salvador, eh, restaurants, malls, uh, discos. Uh, yes. mm -hmm. Discos. Uh, what else? Uh, hacíamos una broma, teacher, de las cariñosas, pero no sé cómo podría ser. No. <risa> No, no, o sea, no sé cómo. No, pero, podría... usted, pero usted no ofrece eso como turismo. Ah, ajá. Okay, 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 okay. Ajá. Es... ok. Uh, ay, me quitaron la idea. Es uh, monu monuments, monuments. Ah, monuments. Uh -huh. Ok. Like that. 
Yes. Okay, monuments. Mm, let's uh, see. Uh, typical food. Typical food restaurants. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Typical food restaurant because it is only in San Salvador. Okay. Los planes de renderos. Así como tal, los planes. Yes. Capital letter planes de renderos. Okay. Because it is a proper now. Solo al principio planes y renderos. <laughs> Así. No. Pero no está, renderos estaba bien. No. Solo, Solo la, la inicial, letra. la inicial ah, de, de, de planes okay, y de okay. Es que no me tienen paciencia. <risa> que si saben cómo soy, ¿para qué me dejan escribir? <risa> <risa> ok, eh, let's see. What else? Um, rent a cars. Oh, bien. Ya está. Uh, rent a cars. Um, gyms. Oh, yes. Gyms. Hotels, five star hotels. Hotels. Sin Marín. Ok. Mm. Theaters, porque hay teatros. Y ese es Museum, ¿verdad? Sin sí, Marín Museum. Sí. Y también es el otro museo. Ya tenemos sí. te teatro arriba. Ah, sí, ¿verdad? Theater, Cinema, Cusca. Ah, Museum Mon. tal vez ya está arriba. Ya está arriba sí, sí. Uh -huh. yes. eh, mm, eh, they, I think they call it necrotourism. Uh, yes. Okay, yes. If they want to visit uh, cemeteries for the monuments, it is in that, and only at night. Yes, necrotourism. Necrotourism. Tourism. Tourism. Mm, from... Okay, excellent, necrotourism. Okay, I think that that is enough. Yeah, let's return Devil's, and let's compare. Uh, Devil's okay. Gate. Ah? Huh? Devil's Gate. ¿Cómo? No, porque no está habilitada. Ah, sí. It sí. is closed. Yeah. Yes. Okay, decide who is going to present it to the class. Decidan quién lo va a presentar para el grupo. Total. Uh, in session. My, Maria Leticia. Do, okay. Do you, it's okay, Maria Leticia. Do you, you agree? are the one, Leti. Ah. Uh, bueno, yo haré el mayor esfuerzo. Okay. If I see this. The attendance teacher? No, okay. In three minutes. Okay. <laughs> While okay. the others get back. Mientras okay. los otros regresan. Okay, here we go. Mm -hmm. right. Now everybody is back from the breakout room. So um, we're going to start presenting your lists. We're going to listen to the first team, and that is group number three. Carlos Ernesto, 
Julio César, María Leticia, and Andrea Lisbeth. Okay. Okay, I'm going okay. to share the slides and my co co-worker Leticia. Co-worker or classmate? Classmate teacher. Sorry. Okay, very well. <laughs> okay, um, let me, please. Okay. I'm going to talk about the amenities in San Salvador. Uh, theater, 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 cinema, Cuscatran Park, mall, market, cultural center, restaurant, spa, hair salon, hospital, eh, museum, así se dice. Museum, uh, museum, museum, renta car, financial center or bank, church, San Salvador, San Salvador, historic, Don, downtown, yes, Universidad del Salvador, mm -hmm. disco, monument, Typical food in restaurant, Los Planes de Renderos, Jeans, Hotel, Necro Tourism. Tourism. Excellent, very well, congratulations. Very well done. Now let's continue with the other team. Team number one, Elizabeth, Johanna, Flor, Catherine, Maria Isabel, and Marvin. Are you ready guys? Knock, knock, somebody in that group. Number one, Flor, Elizabeth, Catherine, Maria, Isabel, and Mervyn. Okay, Flor, are you going to share? Sí, vaya. Eh, de las, de las, ahorita le permita, solo me voy a volver a ubicar. Mientras se ubica usted, le voy a tomar la segunda asistencia, ¿ok? Andrea Lisbeth, where are you? Here, uh, Andrea Lisbeth, knock, knock. Present. Thank you, Miss. Carlos. Present, teacher. Mm. Elizabeth Johanna. Present. Thank you, Miss Johanna. Evelyn. Present. Flor. Here. Present. Auto percent. Freddy Elise. Okay, Freddy. Uh, Hazel, is she here, here. or no? Ah, okay, here. she's here. Uh, Julio Cesar, Present. where are you? Here. Great. Catherine. Present. Mm, Maria Isabel. Isa. Maria Isabel, thank you. thank you, thank you. Leti, Maria Leticia. Present teacher. Marvin. Present. Mateo. Present. Mateo, thank you. Miguel. Present teacher. Thank you. Natalia is absent. Rafa, Rafael. Present. I'm thank here. you, Rudy. Rudy, where are you? He lost the connectivity. Teacher, the yes. picture, teacher. Yeah, hold it, hold it. Okay, Rudy is absent at the moment. Virginia? Present, right teacher. Here. Wendy is absent. And uh, Wilbur? Okay, Wilbur, we read your message via Zoom. Okay, get ready for Flor's uh, presentation and also for the picture, okay? To the count of okay. three, activate your cameras for the picture. Mm. One, two, two and a half, 245, <laughs> 250, and three. 
Ay, let's see, <laughs> Rafael. To that picture, okay? Okay. No know. soportó, no soportó. <laughs> no. To 50-50? No, he, he was not 55. like this. He wa no, because he raised his arm. Uh, but <laughs> the picture was uh, not with that, uh, you know, movement. So uh -huh. now, class, thank you so much. Let's continue. Flor, are you ready now? Yes. Yeah. Okay, yes. please. <clears throat> okay. Um, the, la, the checklist. Pusimos Wi-Fi internet. Laundry service. Restaurant. Supermarket. And single home. ¿Cuál es la última? Single room. Es que no estamos, en nosotros, la instrucción era que tenían que hacer un listado de las amenities que San Salvador le ofrece a los visitantes en general. Ajá, pero ahí estábamos discutiendo si era de la lista o era personal. Entonces, sí, personal no. Mezcla. No, era de San Salvador. No personal. ¿Verdad? Son las Eso amenities que San Salvador le ofrece a los visitantes, ¿sí? Ok, now let's continue with group number two. Hazel, Miguel Ángel, Rafael, and Virginia. Are you ready? Do you have the list? Yes or no? Yes. Ok. Sir. Who's going to uh, present yes, it? It's me presenting, teacher. Really? Yes, of course. Ok. Let me see. Ay. La, la hugoneta es. La hugoneta. The conga no. bus. The conga bus. The conga bus. The conga yes. bus. Se puede okay. ver completa. Yes. Yes, yes sir. Ok. Ah, ok. In the Chero <laughs> trip, um, number one is hotel or landing house. Uh, uh -huh. Number two, city tours. Number three, historical center. Number four, mm -hmm. karaoke bar. Number five, discotheque. Number six, casino. Number seven, recreational park. Number eight, San Salvador Volcanoes Tour. In number nine, uh, shopping malls tour. And number nine, and number malls. nine. Okay, shopping thank you. Tour. Okay. But also churches, iglesias también. Ajá. Yeah. Sí. <laughs> okay. Lo thank you. Para la próxima, para la próxima. Thank Igual you lo, so much. Okay. Todo esto. Okay. Yes, great. Excellent, very creative. Now let's listen to Evelyn, Fredis, Matthew. Are you ready, Evelyn? Okay, yes, teacher. Okay, please, miss. Okay, amenities, amenities in San Salvador is El Boqueron Park, History Center, a monument, Divino Salvador del Mundo, Civic Square, Captain General Gerardo Barrios, okay. Short El Rosario, eh, Planet de Renderos. Ok, very well, excellent. And did all the groups participate? Yes, right? Okay, so now that you are clear about what amenities are, we need to go over the activity the book is requesting from you to do, okay? And here, your turn. Write a checklist about the type of services and amenities you need for your next trip. You have to imagine, okay? Acá sí. Imagínense que usted va a hacer un viaje. En ese sentido, usted se va a quedar en un hotel. ¿Cuáles serían las amenities you're going to need? ¿Cuáles serían las amenities que solicitaría al hotel? ¿Ok? So here you write yours. Acá escriben one, two, three, four, five. Yes. 
when you write your five uh, amenities, then I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms because you are going to ask the other two classmates what are the amenities that you need and you write them, okay? So it is time right now to write five amenities that you would need in your next trip. For example, a single room or double room? I don't know. Maybe a single room or double room if you are going to... Uh, Residential room. No, because if it is, if it is, let's imagine that you are attending a seminar. Ah, okay. And then you need to make the reservation, but four or six people are going to be there. Then you ask for a room for four people, three people, or, or single. I don't know how much money the, you know, the company is going to <laughs> give you for, you know, that trip, a single or, or whatever, okay? Only five that you are going to, to be requesting from the hotel. You're going to be inquiring. Mm -hmm. When you are ready, you tell me, please, okay? Okay. Only mm -hmm. five. And later we're going to share in the breakout rooms because you are going to ask your classmates. As soon as you finish, please tell me, okay? Okay, teacher. Remember, tomorrow and Friday we have classes. Mañana y el viernes tenemos clases. Regresamos el día lunes 10 y terminaríamos el martes 11, okay? Okay. So you have time to update if you are owing me something. Finished. Mm -hmm. Yes? Only five. And you have some of them over here. Or if you need another one, you write it. Down, teacher. Down. Okay. What about the others? Hazel, I think that she's over. Yes? Yes. You finished. And Julio, finished. Finished, teacher. Okay, thank you, Evelyn. <laughs> Great. Uh, Mateo, finished. Miguel, finished. Carlos, finished. Yeah? Yes, teacher. Rafa, yeah. finished. Finished. Ah, oh, long time ago. <laughs> Desde el ejercicio anterior. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Letty finished. Yes. Virginia finished. Mm, long time ago. Yes. Okay, now I'm going to transfer you to the breakout rooms and then you uh, exchange okay, with your partners. Oh, okay. Alguien ya se retiro. I'm going to send you, remember, you need to write what the other two partners have. Okay, go to your groups, please. Go to your groups. Okay. And share your ideas, your list. Miguel Angel, are you okay with your audio? Okay, great. Maria Isabel, if you join the group, it is group number one, yours, okay? Isa? Me is a single room, room service, swimming pool, a conference room, but is 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 
it's our business business trip uh, and the last one playroom Okay. Uh, um, si oh, yeah. me la soy. Okay. Um, uh, in my next trip, I need uh, some amenity. For example, shuttle service. Okay. Laundry service. Uh, four room. Come four. Four, cuatro, cuatro, uh -huh. cuatro cuartos. Four eh, rooms. Eh, Wi-Fi internet. Eh, four, four individual yes. rooms. Four single rooms, yes? Four, four single rooms, yes. Okay. Yes. Four single rooms. And how about you? Yo por eso dije, los cuatro van a estar en el mismo. <laughs> no, come on, come on. It's a single room. Four single rooms, yes. Uh, <laughs> how about you, Evelyn? <laughs> How about with okay. your trips? La four, ¿cuál sería? La qué? Después de four single room, ¿qué me dijo? Because you need uh, five. Yes, uh, mm -hmm. shuttle room, four single room, laundry service, mm -hmm. gym, and Wi-Fi internet. Okay. Okay. And uh, floor, floor, your, uh, okay, your amenities that you are going to be needing. Ya tiene la suya, Flor, um, para que me la dicte. Los amenities, restaurants. Okay. okay. Restaurant. The other Restaurant. one. Uh, laundry service. Okay. Um, cinema. Okay. Um, ¿Cómo puedo decir que um, como que 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 ya como que hay piscina, o sea, piscina es pool, algo así, pero sí. swimming pool, swimming pool, no sé, swimming pool, swimming sí. pool, swimming pool, uh -huh. swimming okay. pool. Y, y balneario, ¿cómo se las cinco, me falta. Una le faltaría. Uh -huh. balneario, balneario. A water center, water center, water center. Water center. Uh, sí, pero okay. eso no tienen, eso no tiene. Eh, eh, balneario es otro lugar. En los hoteles no hay balneario. Solamente uh -huh. tienen este <ríe> eh, swimming pool. A no ah. ser que busque usted un resort. Eso ya es otra cosa. Ah, un resort. Ya, pero ya resort, ya more vacation than business trip. Ya. Yeah. Ok, Flor Morena Rodríguez de Morales. Ah, una me falta, vea. Sí, pero en lo que piensa eso, yo le voy a decir algo más en lo que tiene que pensar. Flor. I need you to stay with me after class. Necesito que se quede un ratito hoy conmigo después de clase. Por favor. ¿Ok? ¿Cómo dice? Necesito que se quede conmigo eh, después de clase. Necesito que se quede conmigo después de clase. Teacher, okay. no puede ser después de vacaciones. Es que estoy en cierre y todavía estoy trabajando. ¿Trabajando? después. Sí, yo trabajo en un banco y todavía estoy... Y ahí está en el banco, ahí está en el banco. No, no, no. Ok. Hasta se le quedó congelado el audio, ¿verdad, <risa> <risa> chicos? Sí, es que el internet aquí es malísimo. ¿Y dónde está? Y si, pues, pues, por eso es que apago la cámara, porque se me... Se me, se se me, congela. Se me ajá. O si no, de repente escucho bien rápido y de repente no escucho o se me sale y tengo que volver. Ayer, ay, ayer estuvo horrible el internet. Ok. 
but now you are ready with the fifth amenity. Sí, está lista con la quinta amenidad. Sí. Sí. Okay. Eh, eh, one apartment with two room, two room, two room. With double two room, room, double room, double room, double room. Lo que pasa es que habitaciones dobles serían cuando yo digo un apartamento con dos habitaciones. Ah, entonces es. no, entonces usted no está en, eh, en un hotel, sino que usted no. está buscando un apartamento. Uh -huh. ¿Sí? Es diferente. Entonces ahí las amenities son diferentes porque es un apartamento, puede que tenga, puede que no tenga swimming pool. Ahí no le van a ofrecer eh, room service. Ah, okay. Ajá, es diferente ahí, ¿ok? Mejor que quede con el double room. No, it's up to her. Es opción de ella, ¿ok? Ah, okay. Pero for como es de business is the conference room porque necesitaríamos una conference room y la number oh, five sí. is playroom. <ríe> okay. Aquí quería salir la picture. Es que aquí quería salir. Yeah, okay, yeah, very strong man. Así. Yeah. Okay, finish class. Yes. Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Miguel, you Tell are always teacher. very close to the clouds. Siempre está bien cerca yes. de las nubes. Pero Aba, un poquito es... bajito de, de, de Rafael, porque Rafael está ah, yeah, más yeah. Es que está yeah, aquí. Yeah. But you todo. are, eh, okay, in the same line. Okay, in the same mood. <laughs> I need to ask you to stay with me today after class, okay? Yes, I'm so ¿Sí? sorry. Yes, you, Miguel. Oh, yes. so, so, because almost everybody is done. Porque la mayor, porque yo sé que yo estuve. Wilber ya yeah. y, 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 y Rafael ya. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay, teacher, no problem. Okay, so let's, yes. let's get back. So we okay. Let, let's return and we share. Class, now that you have shared with your partners in the breakout rooms, I need you, okay, to do the following. I need one volunteer from one group in order to share with the class because now you have all the information. Yes? One volunteer? Mm. Only one? Mm. <laughs> uh, me, teacher. Okay, please. Or team teacher. Excellent. Uh, okay. Okay, um, the checklist for our team is the next. A, a single room, a single room, uh, yeah. two and service room. Number three is Wi-Fi internet. Number four is jacuzzi. And number five is, what do you say? Conference room. Conference, Conference room. room. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you very Only. much. That is what you had in common. Yes? Yes. Excellent. Congratulations. Very well. Okay, class. Listen, I need you to continue working in the platform. Lo que me deben tareas, tienen que hacerlas, por favor, para que después no haya problema, ¿verdad? Y no se atrase, recuerden que viene la vacación y todo alegría, felicidad y nos olvidamos de lo demás. Entonces yo necesito que continúen trabajando. Recuerden, hoy hemos iniciado la sección número 4, unidad número 4. We are like this. 
to finish. We are like this to finish, okay? So class, I have to tell you that I really appreciate your attendance and your responsibility. Have a good night. Have Relax. Good night. See you tomorrow. Only Miguel stays with the teacher today, okay? Bye-bye for the rest. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good See night. See you. you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Only Miguel stays with the teacher <laughs> and Rafa with the big smile. Yes. Bye -bye. No. <laughs> Have a good yeah. night. Take care. <laughs> See you tomorrow. Bye-bye, Rafa. Bye bye, Miguel. Bye bye, Julio. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye, Matthew. Mateo. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Why I? Choose... You have two devices. Tiene dos dispositivos, sí. Miguel. Yes. Eh, la computadora y el I teléfono. See. No. Maybe by uh, see, but... tal vez por accidente okay. conectó el otro o los tiene vinculados. Lo que pasa es que actualicé la, la, la sesión porque no me mm. no, no la escuchaba. Entonces posiblemente ah. como ya era después de las 10, ya me creó como otra sesión. Okay. Quiero ver si me puedo desconectar de aquí. No, but that's okay. Let's okay. get this started, no problem. Bye bye, Rafa. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Cuando no les toque ahí se queda. Vaya, se desconecto. Ya solo hay uno. Okay, here we're going to practice pronunciation, sir. Okay. So here okay. we go. I need you to read alone this conversation for me, please. I am L the agent. agent. Yes. Okay. Mark Travel Agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Mrs. Mrs. Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a... Uy, I'm sorry. I'm going to stay <laughs> three days. No problem. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need a shuttle service? Yes, please. Now let's switch. Okay. Uh, Mark's agent, Mark's travel agency. How can I help you? Good morning. I need a reservation for a single room. I'm going to travel to Costa Rica on April 14th. Sure. May I have your name, please? Of course. I'm Rosa Puentes. Thank you, Miss Puentes. How long are you going to stay? I'm going to stay three days. Are you going to stay in a smoking or non-smoking room? Non-smoking, please. Are you going to need the shuttle service? Yes, please. Okay, very well. Now... Here, we're going to have a feedback on the reading of this article, yeah? Okay. okay. Begin reading paragraph number one, please. Okay. <clears throat> no lo veo. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Ahora sí. Uh, there are many workplace etiquette guidelines, but the most important is to be punctual to your office if you are late because you had an emergency. That is okay. However, habitual late comers are never appreciated in any organization. If you get to your office on time, you show that you are responsible and you respect the organization. If you know that you will be late, then a good etiquette guidelines will be to call the concert authority authority and report the reason why you are late okay now go over uh paragraph number two the second one etiquette. okay it is uh, your turn et etiquette is also important when you have to communicate with employees or clients in any part of the world 
in those cases, it is necessary, necessary to have good snowlet or the workplace email etiquette of other countries. Is the official email, you need to mention the subject clearly and be consistent. You also need to include all the important details. You should use formal and grammatically correct language for emails. Okay, continue with the next paragraph. In addition, knowledge of telephone etiquette in the workplace is very essential. We have to speak on the telephone at some point during our daily work. Be polite when you talk to your employees. Uh, when you talk to your employees or supervisor, listen to what they say carefully and do not interrupt. Be sure your voice is clear when you speak to avoid wrong interpretations. Okay. Etiquette guidelines are important even when you are celebrating with your coworkers. If you get a call when you are eating, Say excuse me, and then receive the call. Do not talk loudly, loudly while eating, and remember to close your mouth when you should. Uh, sh you should remember that your behavior and manners are under observation. Following etiquette guidelines can play a very viral role for future promotions. Very well. Now I need to suggest that talk, you don't pronounce the letter L, talk, talk. Okay. So the L is not pronounced, talk, T-A-K, talk, okay. loudly, loudly, employees, because you have it two times, employees, the okay. emphasis goes in the last syllable. Employees, again, talk. Knowledge, the letter K is not pronounced. You say knowledge, knowledge. Knowledge. Concise, Concise. knowledge, again, okay? Cases, plural, cases. And only that for the rest. In plural is case. Case, in plural, case. cases, cases. Okay. This is plural cases, plural, okay. And now let's go over this other short conversation. You are Luis and I'm Amanda. Do you often send emails? Yes, I do. Is it appropriate to use abbreviations in business emails? No, it is not professional. I see. Would you share more tips to write effective emails? Yeah, sure. Now let's switch, you begin. Do you often send the emails? Yes, I do. It is appropriate to use abbreviation in business emails? No, it is not professional. I see. Could you sure share more tips to write effective emails? Yeah, sure. Here's something. Because it is a question, we say, is it? Is it not it is? Because it is, is affirmative. The question is, is it? Okay, please read this question again. Is, is, it, it, appropriate, is it appropriate to use uh -huh. abbreviation in business email? Is it? Okay, great. Repeat after me, appropriate. Appropriate. No. Okay, appropriate. Uh, appropriate. Yeah, the same as it is written. Appropriate. Appropriate. Uh, appropriate. Okay, because many people say it as in Spanish, appropriate, and that is not the word, okay? Appropriate. And the last one, <clears throat> this one. I am Claudia and you are Raul. I okay. can't believe it. Robert is addicted to his phone. Did you see him? You're right. He should not chat in meetings. Absolutely. That is not polite. He should ask where his message after the meetings. And we should not talk about him. That's not polite. 
either. Agree. We should help him instead. Now let's switch. You begin and I continue. Okay. I can believe. I can believe it. Robert is addicted to his phone. Did you see him? You're right. He shouldn't he should not chat in a meeting. Absolutely. That is not a that is not polite. He should answer his messages after the meeting, and we should not talk about him. That's not polite either. Okay. I agree. We should help him instead. Okay, so listen, you have either, either, two pronunciations for this word, either, either, both are okay, yeah? Is and with S to the final or is Either's or either? No, either, 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 either. Puede decir either, pero lo puede pronunciar either. Mm -hmm. And here in answer, you don't pronounce the W. Forget about W when pronouncing. Answer, repeat after me, answer. Answer. Okay, answer, very well. And uh, mm -hmm. here is, but yes, you... Talk. Switch, yeah, you monitor, yes. and that is the idea that you remember and then you switch immediately, okay, at the moment. So repeat after me, answer. Answer. Talk. Talk. Either. 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 Very well. And here, if you remember, we were working with uh, Would You and Would You Mind that we went deeply on that and this was an exercise for the consolidation and we have uh, also this article but i'm looking for a short conversation so we can practice because it is very interesting right you begin you are luis and i am janet okay did you enjoy the seminar yes i did i learned a lot tell me more um, I updated my networking skills. I learned to move from small to smart talk. Great. So did you make new contacts? Yes, I did. I exchanged a business cards with 10 people. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. Now I begin. Did you, did you enjoy the seminar? Yes, I did. I learned a lot. Tell me more. I updated my networking skills. I learned to move from a small to a smart talk. Great. So did you make new contacts? Yes, I did. I exchanged business cards with 10 people. Awesome. Repeat after me, updated. Updated. Excellent. Very well. So when you are focused, you do it in the correct way. Congratulations and thank you for giving me your time. Go to sleep. Have a good night. Sleep thank well you. and see you tomorrow. Okay. Bye bye. Thank you. Good night. Have see a good night. Tomorrow. Bye. See you. Bye.